Well, hello and welcome to I Love Gay at Home. And today we're we're down in Atlanta, meeting with Bill Dickinson. Bill, how are you? Matt, nice to see you. Same Thanks here. for having me on today. Absolutely. And yeah, just uh, I guess tell the world and tell our folks, uh, you know, who you are, what you do, your company, and so forth. Thank you for that. So uh, again, Bill, and uh, I do. I am in the leadership space. So that means I have a small company called C Three Leadership for confidence, competence, and credibility in leadership. Yeah. Both what I hope to model and what I hope to foster and develop in other people. Yeah. And as an independent contractor, small business, I hang my hat with a few other companies and I do senior leadership development and executive coaching. Wow. Have you been and doing I do it, it for... And I do it as a proud gay man and professional. <laughs> have you been doing this for a while? I have been doing this for many years. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, probably close to 30, but I've been doing, I've been in Atlanta five years okay. in mid in midtown with, and a lot of my clients are, are local with some being national. Yeah. But well, what kind of, what kind of clients do you work with? Variety of industries, uh, for profit, not for profit. Um, I'm really proud right now to be working with, uh, a couple of companies called tire hub. Yeah. Uh, stakeholders of Goodyear and Bridgestone, I'm working with Park Mobile. I work with a company called PCBB, uh, Ameriprise Financial. So a lot of different sectors, a lot of different leaders, and all in a place right now that are trying to pivot, understand, and care for the people. Yeah, yeah. And so I help them with that. Excellent. And you're part of the, the now it's called, uh, it's the LGBT uh, business chamber there. What is it called? Georgia? Called Out Georgia. Out Georgia. I should. So uh, it form Atlanta's Atlanta's chapter formally yeah. changed its name maybe six months ago, and is now representing the entire state of Georgia, not simply the city of Atlanta. Yeah, excellent. So you're very involved, and you probably do when there, we're when we're allowed to. You probably do quite a bit of networking, I'd assume, as well. I, yeah, and they're a great organization, and yeah, yeah. I, the executive director, I think, very highly of Chris Excellent. Lugo. Yeah. yeah. Well, how have you adapted now that, uh, you know, you probably can't see as yeah. many clients in, in, in the real world? Here, right. So. Well, you know, um, like most of us, we're hunkering down. Yeah. I think uh, uh, Cesar and I have been very responsible with that. But a lot of my clients now, I am seeing through Zoom. Yeah. So whether yeah. it's whether it's a coaching client, it's it's a webinar. I'm facilitating a meeting, uh, and it seems to work. I'm I'm actually highly motivated by it, and I love seeing the faces on the screens. And 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 as I shared with you earlier, a big part of what I'm trying to do right now is to fac facilitate and model empathy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, just because folks are feeling all kinds of stuff as they're trying to do their work, and for some of them, worried about their work. Yeah. So um, I'm, I'm a big proponent of leaders exercising empathy and facilitating psychological safety uh, for them and their, their teams and their colleagues. Yeah. I have a feeling your skill set and your and your empathy are going to be very well needed here for the rest of the year. Well, I, um, I, I, I think if I can bring that to others yeah. as they as they hone their leadership and their care for their people, then I'm doing what I love to do. Yeah. So yeah. I want to I want to set them up for success. It shows. I can see it. <laughs> I yeah, can see it in your you. face. Yeah, thank oh, you. Well, no, thank you. Was there any other uh, final words you wanted to tell our audience? That uh, in these times here, I think it's highly important we exercise our own self leadership. And that means we care for ourselves. Yeah. We're not too hard on ourselves. We give ourselves room to pivot, to grow, to be open and certainly to care for one another, professionally 
and personally. I'd like to leave you with that. I love that. Well, thank you so much for being here with us. And uh, mm -hmm. I look forward to connecting with you here at the next, uh, maybe an NGLCC convention or something up upcoming this year. Matt, thank you. And for all you do as well. We need you. what you do. All right? Take care now.